everyone, how's it going? I hope everyone's doing fantastic, staying safe. Today is uh, Father's Day, uh, at least here in the United States. Uh, it is the 16th of June, 2024. And yes, today we do celebrate dads and dad-like figures. Uh, we all understand, we, we are all aware that uh, there, there are many people who may not have dads either because uh, they either passed away or they they were just not around and stuff like that. Uh, one thing's for certain, many of us are appreciative of the things that fathers do, that dads do. And uh, I, I just wanted to give my two cents. I, I do believe that fathers are uh, amazing creatures. Uh, I myself am not a father, I'm just a regular dude. I'm, I'm single, let alone a dad. Uh, I would like to be a father one day, but I would need to gain myself a uh, a lady friend first <laughs> before I even uh, think about doing that. Uh, but yeah, you know, fathers are great. I do have a father figure who's currently around. <laughs> uh, my dad passed away like around 2012, um, a little bit before I graduated from high school. And, it, it, of course, it was a, a tough moment for me, but at the same time, I was like, I, I'm just happy that he's not suffering anymore. And I thankfully have my mom, my mother, who's, you know, still around with me, you know, thank goodness. And my father figure, who I do see as my spiritual dad in a way. Uh, I always do talk to him and we go out and eat somewhere. He uh, he always gets on my nerves, I get on his nerves, but you know, in the end, he is still my dad in a way. So I, ap I appreciate him, at least. But I just wanted to make this video essentially giving my props, uh, my congratulatory wishes to all the dads in the world, because in the end, um, Dads are amazing, and I I understand that there are very shaky, I don't know if that's the word, very complicated relationships that many people may have with their fathers. I understand that, and so I can't really say for certain, I, I can't say you shouldn't feel a certain way about your father, because I... I know there are things that go on in life that usually makes it a very difficult uh, action. Uh, it, it makes it hard to appreciate your parents uh, as much as the next person because of that. But all I can say is that be happy that you at least have a father that at least takes care of you or at least thinks of you. And even, even if you don't have something like that, all I can do is, uh, all I can say is to look at the positive side, you know, be the better person and just be grateful that you've had, a, you know, someone to bring you into this world. And I'm not gonna, <laughs> I, I was gonna say a few things, but I, I, I'd rather not. Uh, all I can say is, uh, be happy for that one person who you do see as your father, as your dad. It doesn't have to be your biological father it doesn't have to be uh, like a spiritual father it could be someone you know uh, blood related or maybe it's just someone you look up to uh, because I do know of uh, I do have three people that I know of actually that uh, they don't have their fathers around um, mainly because they're just simply not around you know they've they've gone to the afterlife um, but they know of others who essentially took up the role of dad for them. And those are the kind of people, those are the kind of men that I do appreciate. Um, ignoring all of the talk of quote-unquote toxic masculinity that you hear on the internet, I don't care about that. Like, sure, yes, it exists. Okay, we go against that, all right? The kind of masculinity that we need are the men who are willing to take up that responsibility that someone else wouldn't. To raise our child and to raise our young, to raise a family. Um, I would like to raise a family one day, but again, <laughs> I would need to, uh, step one, find a girl. <laughs> you know, I can't, 
I assure I can do the whole go outside and just find someone, but I'm not gonna do that. I, I care about um, having a family one day and, you know, having a close relationship with the person that I love to create a family and be the best that I can be. But for now, hey, I'm just making videos, uh, playing Warframe. <laughs> Eventually, I'll find someone. I'm, I'm sure of it. I'm not too uh, depressed about that. I, I do get lonely sometimes, but hey, it's okay. I, part of life. Anyways, uh, this video is simply to shout out all of the dads in the world. And uh, believe it or not, yes, I do appreciate all the moms out there in the world. All the single mothers who have to take up, uh, essentially, double shift for the man and the woman either because the um either because the father is just not there anymore or they have to be away for a certain amount of time so the mom has to pick up the slack of course yes um and i do appreciate i do appreciate all the moms out there also doing dad stuff but in the end um this is to all of those men and women who essentially take up the role of father of dad because without them society would essentially collapse one way or another we need we need father figures uh, father figures are what uh, you know keep keep that uh, that strength of um, of character for this for society and at, at some point i don't know what i'm talking about this is just you know my opinion but in the end, uh, just to finish off this video, uh, I appreciate all the dads out there. Thank you so much for doing what you do. Hopefully, I'll be a dad one day and show my child, my children, you know, the way of life and how to be a great person. And that's it. <laughs> I got nothing else uh, at this point. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Happy Father's Day and y'all stay safe.